People always ask, what is it that makes payroll pay so easy to use? Of course, there are many reasons, but the best place to start showing why payroll processing and PayDirt can be so much easier than what you're currently doing would be in a batch, actually processing a payroll. So let's go to batches. I have a batch that I've started by adding a few employees to it. The employees are on the list here. I haven't done any other entry. Some of these employees won't need any entry because they're salaried, such as this one. But other employees will need to have uh, time entered that represents the amount of time that they've worked in this payroll period. So I'll go through and enter some time for each of these employees. And you'll notice that I'm able to stay on the keyboard instead of using the mouse, which makes data entry much quicker. And the pay codes that I need to do entry in are at the top of the list and I can go ahead and do all of those entries. In addition to regular payroll items, there might be some payable items or some bank time elements to any given employee's time entry. So I'll just go through and make all of the entries necessary to complete this payroll. And when I've done that, I'll be at, on the last employee and I'll just need to click on the checks tab and the program will see that these employees need to be calculated, that is their government deductions need to be determined and any other benefit accrual or company deduction elements as well. And I'll just click OK to allow it to do that. And when I'm done with that, I can print the checks. First I need to make sure that I have the proper starting check number. You'll notice that some of these employees are going to be paid by check, some by direct deposit, and all I need to do to prepare both of those is click the Do Checks Plus Direct Deposits button. The program creates a direct deposit file for me and tells me the total amount that's being um, uploaded or sent to the bank. And I'll click the OK button, and at that point it prints the checks. In this case, I'm actually putting these checks up on screen, but you would send them to your printer. And once that process is done and the checks are numbered and the direct deposits are also numbered, I can post the batch. At that point, payroll will be completed and PayDirt Payroll will send all of the accounting from payroll to your general ledger program. And that's it for completing a pay run in PayDirt Payroll.